Hallo, mein Name ist Bianca and today we're talking about adjectives used as nouns. Now many adjectives in Germany Now many adjectives in German can be used as nouns. You can say for example, Anne ist schon sehr erwachsen or die Erwachsenen sitzen an dem großen Tisch. Now many adjectives in German Now many adjectives in German can be used as nouns. So in this sentence, Anne ist schon sehr erwachsen, we have the adjective erwachsen, but in this sentence, die Erwachsenen sitzen an dem großen Tisch, we have the adjective become a noun, die Erwachsenen. The endings for the adjective nouns can change depending on the gender, the number, or the case of the nouns, and whether it's preceded by a der or an ein word. So for example, seine Verlobte ist sehr hübsch. Seine Verlobte. Right? The gender is die Verlobte. Female. Or we can say, ein Jugendlicher hat das Auto gekauft. So we have an ein word here in the beginning. Ein Jugendlicher. Adjective nouns that refer to concepts are always neuter and are only used in the singular. They often follow the indefinite words like alles, etwas and nichts or the quantitative word viele and <coughs> or the quantitative word viele and wenig. For adjectival nouns after etwas, nichts, viel or wenig, you use the endings for unpreceded neuter adjectives. After alles, use the endings you would after a der word. So an example is, möchtest du etwas warmes trinken? So we have an es ending. Warm, warmes, etwas warmes. The, neuter, the unpreceded neuter adjective. Or you can say, ich wünsche dir alles Gute. And we have the E ending in Gute. Gut, Gute. Because we have the... Because we have alles in front of it. Okay, very good. So let's do some practice here. Please fill in the, the blanks with um, the verb in the parentheses. Decide if it's an adjective or a noun. And um, pause the PowerPoint, fill in your answers, and then continue so we can go over the answers together. And here are the answers. And here are the answers. Die Kleine ist süß. And here are the answers. Die Kleine ist süß. So we have the noun here, Kleine. Der große Hund ist schwarz. It's an adjective, it's große. It describes the dog. Die Armen haben kein Geld. Armen is or noun here. It moves from an adjective to a noun. Ein Fremd... Eine Fremde geht mit uns ins Kino. Fremde becomes a noun. Okay, very good. 
Let's summarize. Many adjectives in German can be used as nouns. The ending for the adjectival nouns change depending on the gender, number or case of the nouns and whether it's preceded by a der or an ein word. So like any other nouns, it depends on gender, number and case. Adjectival nouns that refer to concepts are always neuter and are only used in the singular. They often follow indefinite words like alles, etwas and nichts or the quantitative words viele and wenig. And for adjectival nouns, after etwas, nichts, viel or wenig, you use the endings for unproceeded neuter adjectives. And at last, after alles, you use the endings you would after a der word. Very good. Thank you for listening today. Und bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss.